Metro Home Building Center starting gate is in motion here for race eight. It is time for the jackpot. High five, Century Gaga at even money. Eight to five on the eight. Emmy Lou Hayes. We'll see who gets the job done here in race eight. It should be a good one. Over to Vance Cameron for the call. Acro Turi, I can do it. Bayside Alexis. Century Gaga, Badlands Giovanna. Private dancer, Magical Lily Bear. Emmy Lou Hayes on the grandstand side, top of the stretch. Here they come. And away they go. Off and pacing. Century Gaga leaving out on the rail. Acro Turi coming from the far outside is Emmy Lou Hayes. Third, the fourth one around the turn is I Can Do It. Away in fifth is Bayside Alexis. Badlands Giovanni six. Seventh, that is Private Dancer. And the trailer is Magical Lily Bear. They're on the back stretch, led by the newcomer to Charlottetown, Century Gaga. Up and out here on the outside, Emmy Lou Hayes is coming to call early. Racing alone in third, Acro Turi back into fourth. I can do it. Fifth is Bayside Alexis. Racing six is Badlands Giovanna with Private Dancer. Magical Lily Bear, the trailer, 28 and three opened it up, and Emmy Lou Hayes found the lead for Mark Bradley. Century Gaga goes second, Acro Turi third. Back into fourth is I Can Do It. Going to the outside, fifth is Bayside Alexis. In up the rail, sixth is Badlands Giovanna. Private Dancer is seventh, trailing the field. Magical Lily Bear, 58 and two was the half. They're into the panic turn for the second time. Going to the five eight. The leader, Emmy Lou Hayes, Century Gaga on her back. Coming first up on the outside, third, Bayside Alexis. Acro Turi fourth, Badlands Giovanna fifth. Magical Lily Bear is now sixth. I can do it, shuffle to seventh. Outside the trailer, Private Dancer. They're at three quarters, and Emmy Lou Hayes along the rail, the leader. Second on the outside is Bayside Alexis. Century Gaga's in the pocket, third. Magical Lily Bear is coming fourth. Three quarters in one, 29. And three, they're homeward bound, and it's up for grabs here. Emmy Lou Hayes, Magical Lily Bear has come now from worst to first, going to the wire. Magical Lily Bear and McPherson, second, that's Bayside Alexis, Century Gaga, third, the mile, two minutes, one fifth. Okay, here's the slow-mo for race number eight from Rich Orange in Charlottetown this afternoon, uh, Kurt. And this mare, you talked about her in the pre-race, so you liked her for part of your ticket here today. She comes from worst to first to get it all. Yeah, incredible effort here from the seven magical Lily Bear as they sat third over with Corey McPherson, watching the early action as the eight and four kind of duked it out going to the quarter. And that was Emmy Lou Hayes and Bradley finally getting to the front there. 28 and three, half 58 and two. Century Gaga was sitting in the two hole and watching it all transpire was the seven magical Lily Bear who sat off the early pace and rallies around the last turn and just drives down the lane past them all to get it done here. Time of the mile, two minutes, one fifth. Bayside Alexis and Dowling, gutsy first over effort. They get the deuce and Century Gaga and Brody McPhee round out the tractor. But it's magical Lily Bear and McPherson to win the eighth here at Red Shores.
Magical Lily Bear arriving at the 8th race winner's circle by pacing Philly 3 by Steelhead Hanover from the Brandon's Cowboy Dam, Magical Cowgirl, owned by Barry and Reuben Martin of Sydney, Nova Scotia. Ronnie Gass has the training double. Corey McPherson has a driving double. And the Philly stops the clock in two minutes. And oh, one fifth. Magical Lily Bear in the eighth. 